Good evening. Good evening, fish people. How's it going? I'm very tired. We got a bunch of stuff done. That's still green. What are you going to do? Don't know. Changed a bunch of water. Once upon a time, there was a little dragon and a green monster. And one day, the dragon's boss took one of the big lights off of the green monster to help it not be green. But at the same time, the boss added two little lights, one there and one there. So one big light, two little lights. How's that help? I'm not sure, but it's still green. That's today's children's story brought to you by Dan Slee. What are you guys doing? What are you guys doing at midnight? Because I'm still all alone. I think Sparky's depressed because I'm not LRB. Yeah, the fish do look super happy. I'm pretty proud of the uh, fish keeping I've been doing here. They're pretty, they're pretty good. Everybody's bellies are full. There's no leftover tropical granules anywhere. These discus are sweet. I think I'm doing all right. Who else here? Banoski Tank is here, what's up? Honeybee's here, what's up? Bob is here, hello Bob. And Dan Slee is here. Good morning and or good night. How are you? Oh, you're watching Dan's fish room tour and you paused it? Thanks, bro. Thanks, bro. I'm super jealous right now. Like, I'm having a moment. Sarah just texted me and they're on their way to Dean's house. And I love Dean. They're gonna learn so much cool stuff. And I'm gonna sit in this hot fish room. But that's okay. Because I learned some things today. I don't remember them, but I learned them. Mostly I learned that if you kick uh, the quarry rack, which is the rack made with cinder blocks with your ankle, it hurts real bad. It hurts real bad. I learned that. Aquarium of Peninsula. Hello. Yeah, I kicked it. I kicked it with my foot, and now it hurts. What you gonna do? Boss's chair, right? This is the comfortable chair. I'm like sunk down in it. My stand is nice. Did I build it myself? This is not my stand. I work for LRB Aquatics. I am at his house. This is Lucas Bretz's stand, and I think he bought it. I don't think he built that one. But it is pretty nice. Yeah, holy green water, Batman. I hit it with a 50%. I, I, it, didn't, it didn't help. I'm too lazy to link, so here's a dragon. <laughs> ah, Dan. Dan's funny. Mr. Fax Machine says, Hi, Haley. Happy Friday. How did y'all do tonight? I did all right. Um, I don't know about y'all. I'm alone. It's just me and Sparky. You talking about me and Sparky? Me and Sparky are doing great. What's up, Cody-san? I'm in charge around here right now. I'm in the boss chair, and I'm, uh, I'm getting stuff done. While Lucas and Sarah get to hang out with Dean. Ha. <sighs> Candy, are there even snails on that website? I hope there's snails on that website. I got snails for days. Did I find any fry today? I did. They're in a rainbow tank on Rainbow Row. I think they're red Bopoga lasers, and I think they're community breeding. Shh. Shh. I think they're community breeding. You're never alone in this hobby. That's right, Mr. Fags Machine, because all I have to do is hit the live button, and there are my people. So I don't have to deal with this haunted fish room by myself. I swear the mascara barbs see things that aren't there. Oh, my gosh. Says only two items left in stock. Great. I got more than 20 snails, bro. I got all the snails. 
but you can't really fault him because I really hope he's not paying attention to the website and he's having a good time and relaxing. Seem it seems like they're 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 having a good time and chilling out. Cause I'm sending updates, but I'm not getting updates back. Thankfully, Sarah tells me some things, so, yeah. I just hope they're having fun. I hope they come back super relaxed and happy, and tomorrow I will have time, because I got enough done today, that I'm gonna clean the whole house, so they come back to a nice clean house, everything swept and cleaned up, and all the trash out, and all that jazz, so that they come home all nice and kosher. Uh, Fishtube wants to know, are you bothering me? Why am I sending an email to Corey, the master? I don't know. He got a bottle of wine, womp womp. Yeah, I heard about that. I didn't catch that live stream live that he did, but I caught it afterwards and I watched it while I was filling a 125. And I heard all about that heart-shaped bed and all the craziness y'all were talking about. That was fantastic. I hope they do all that and just have a fantastic time. Yeah, nice clean house, everything kosher. That's what they're gonna come home to. Hopefully. I haven't broken anything yet. Hey Anthony's fishy friends, what's up? Who else is here? Cichlids 23's here, what's up? Jess Shrimp Granny's here. What up? Fish tubes here. Shelby Ray's here. Shelby Ray. My friend. Yeah, I'm glad YouTube's sending out my uh, notifications because they weren't earlier. It's probably because I keep going live at random times of the night. I'm not really sure. I don't YouTube well. I just do things and stuff and have fun. Robin finally caught me live. New fan. Says I'm awesome. I'm not that awesome, but I'm real. And what's up, Robin? Thanks for... Showing up for my late live stream where I'm all alone in front of the screen 240. Having a good time. What are you doing? What kind of fish you got? These aren't my fish. Well, they're my fish right now. What if I just take everything out of this 240 and fill it with rope fish? You think I can get rope fish that fast? Hmm. Decisions, decisions. Um, Just Shrimp Granny says, I've got to figure out how to make YouTube make noise. Like, what kind of noise? Fishtube's apparently a Cory VIP. Didn't know he had VIPs. You know who's a Oddball Aquatics VIP? Bob Kaler. <laughs> Candy Overhauls. And Pam, wherever she is, she's probably still in Big Easy's live stream hanging out. Oh, this chair is so comfortable, I'm going to fall asleep. <sighs> Fish tube's against you. No. No. Robin says, I can't keep fish where I am, but I used to have five tanks in my old apartment. Blackwater species, I missed them, so I live, I live through you guys. Live vicariously, I love that. That's the way I keep a lot of fish, is vicariously through other people, because I don't want to keep them. Do I ship fish I sell? I don't. Lucas Bretz does. My boss, LRBAquatics.com. He does ship the fish that he breeds and sells. You could overnight some rope fish from the wet spot. I could. I could do that. Is it worth getting fired? I'm not sure. Probably not. It would be hilarious, though. Hello, world. How are you? He didn't do, well, he did like 15 minutes of Q&A to do. I hope you're doing fine, because it's Q&A time. Mostly it was stare at random fish tubers time again. Um, no. <laughs> no, Candy, is it not, is it not good? It's not good. <laughs> uh, my knee really hurts. It must be a bit getting ready to rain. I got some knee pain going on, probably because it kicked the Cory rack. Who knows? Who knows? It was something though, right? I did do something. I'm doing things. 
What would be, oh, the best troll to put the rope fish in there, wouldn't it? No, the best troll would be if I sneak one nano fish in here into a random tank, tell no one and see who finds it. Just one tiny little nano fish. Just to see if he notices. Diabolical. I'm having diabolical thoughts. <laughs> Please do that, says Mr. Fire Machine. Oh my god. Ah, uh, y'all are gonna get me fired. That's too funny. Two, it's 240 gallons of green nightmare, right? I actually kind of love it though because when you're watching it, when it's green like this, just fish randomly come out at you and they pop and they're super happy. So I kind of love it. You gotta kind of love it. Yeah, y'all are y'all are bad bad influence on me. I already have these bad thoughts. I don't need y'all egging me on. So many randomness, random things. Um, definitely having some knee pain. Sarah and Lucas are banging on our bed right now. No, they're not. They're in Dean's house playing with his lungfish, which is what I want to do. Good God, fish tube. I agree. I don't think so. I think they're at Dean's house. I'm pretty sure LRB found the betta I've been looking for since January, so good for him. Yeah, he's got a really nice new betta playing with his lungfish. <laughs> Fish innuendos. Dan Slee, fish innuendos. They're playing with his lungfish. What's up, 44 mag guy? I would say, does anybody want to see anything? I can walk around and show things, but I might go Lego Lucas. So if you don't care if I go Lego Lucas, I can show people things. But that's up to y'all, because I'm really enjoying this chair. And $10 in super chats for her. It's <laughs> uh, funny. Feed the fish. I already fed the fish. I can't feed the fish again. If I feed the fish again, there might be a tetracolor tropical granule left somewhere, and Lucas might find it, and then I'm fired. I cannot feed the fish again. Although those rainbows would probably eat again. Anthony's Fishy Friends says, I broke my high flow pump I used for water changes. These changes are horrible. Oh, oh, wait, are you using a pump or are you using a bucket? <sighs> those tanks are looking fire, though. I cleaned all those today. I cleaned all those today. I cleaned all those today. I'm cleaning tanks. Uh, enjoying downtime? Yeah, I'm enjoying it. Fishtube says you have work for me too. Don't get me upset. Oh, Lord, Fishtube, you and your threats. I sent your email to Gary. I got his email address in between fill and tanks. I sent your email over there. I will await his response. You're very welcome. I would never forget... If I can help it. So, thank you for your $5 super chat. And also, I am awaiting response from the Rainbow God as to your GHKH question. You always like watching the Guppy Frat House? We can go to the Guppy Frat House. Hang on. Let's go to the Guppy Frat House. Look, I cleaned all these today. Aren't they looking fly? Those are looking fly. Gary don't carry is super busy, that's right. Someone out there needs a fancy feast? No, they don't. I already fed them fancy feast today. I cleaned those today. That one's still green. Cleaned all those today. Let's see what else. I cleaned all these right here. They're looking good. Those are looking good. That one's looking super good. This one's still a little bit green, but there's babies up there. Green Junior, yeah, there's babies in that one. I don't know if you can see them. They're super teeny. Those are Doherty eyes. And then I cleaned these today. Womp, womp, and womp. 
Okay, so babies do like green water. They're up there living their best life, loving life. This tank is looking HD. Fantastic. What are you guys doing? Are you still hungry? Stop acting hungry. I can't feed you anymore. I already fed you all the foods. What's my favorite crypt here? Mm, hang on. Stand by. We shall find a crypt. Too many green tanks. Better get working. Yeah, right, fish tube. Thanks for the $5 super chat. I've been working. Let's see here. Am I going Lego Lucas? Okay, let's make sure I don't go Lego Lucas. Okay, that's looking pretty fly. That's looking all right. And there's the bachelor tank. Hello, bachelors. How are you? Are you doing well? Did I clean your tank okay? I think I did. Have you guys th seen this thing that Lucas got? This magnifying glass? It's pretty sweet. I kind of love it. Kind of love it. Anyway. Don't show it. Am I okay so far? All right, good. Good, we're not Lego Lucas yet. A lot of glare. A lot of glare happening. A lot of lights still on. He said secret video on it. Oh, yeah, don't look at that. This is nothing. Yeah, that's that's nothing. Uh, he doesn't have that thing. Uh, look over here. <laughs> Thanks, fish tube. What magnifying glass? I don't know what you're talking about, Sakana Katana. <laughs> that's just a thing that's over there. It's right there. It's just a thing that's over there that he has. I don't know nothing about it. And he can do his little secret video. I'm doing secret videos. He's at Dean's house. Whatever. Whatever. Yeah, that thing's pretty cool. I really like it. The only thing I don't like about it is scraping that tank. I'll tell you guys the secret video. It's don't sell my any bettas secret video. Yeah. He's hoarding those bettas. But they're looking sweet. Yeah, that's some Marisha. Ugh. Chattanooga Ed, what's up? I love this bachelor tank. It needs more filters. No, it doesn't. Look at it. It doesn't need a filter at all. Oh, my favorite crypt. I don't know. I really like these. And let's see. Hang on. This. This is my favorite crypt. Right here. Pink Flamingo Crypt. I want a whole tank of them, and I want them pink. Fish tubes says I'm impressed. Last time I left my house to someone, they turned it into a lab. Holy Lord. What's the advantage of green water? Babies love it. Fish love it. Everything loves it. Does that need a root tab? Probably not. Not in this substrate. Look at this substrate. That's nothing but goodness. But I think to get them all the way pink, they need CO2. Because you see how that's not pink? I mean, it's a little bit pink, but it could be, like, more pink. Um, I think it's because it needs CO2. Now this, this is pink. Look at this stuff up here. It's, like, purple. On the underside of the leaves, that stuff's going crazy. Look at that. I like that. Well, if Lucas sells bettas, it brings luck to everyone. Oh, yeah, I still trust you, fish tube. It's okay. You'll be all right. What's up, Pam? Green water's only bad for viewing. I don't think it's that bad for viewing until it gets to, like, pea soup, and then it becomes a problem. Shelby Ray says they're all at Dean's house eating Dean's cooking, strolling through Dean's fish room, sitting around, talking cool fishy things. I'm green with envy. I am green with envy. I'm green with envy. You got some of that one? I think so. Which one? This one? This one you got some of, Candy. That one for sure. I know, because we pulled it out of that tank in the garage. So I know you got that. That, I'm not so sure about. That's a pretty cool plant. Focus, focus. This plant is super cool because look, it has these long leaves when it's growing underwater. See these long leaves? I don't know what, uh, Lago? Hang on, I know what it is. I know what it is. Uh, not that one. It's this. That's what it is. Lago Grande? But no, look, 
it has these long leaves when it's growing underwater. And then when it hits the surface, see those round leaves? It puts those out. Isn't that weird? Isn't that weird? There's weird things. Does he have endlers? He has uh, all the endlers. Isn't that trippy, Dan? That's trippy. What's up, Turbo Fish? Endlers? We got endlers all day long. Where's some endlers? Uh-oh, I gotta get this dehumidifier. Pause. Pause for the cause. Pause for the dehumidifier cause. You guys stay right there. Oh, okay. Ugh. Okay, I got it. I got the dehumidifier. And where was I going? Endlers. So, endlers, 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 endlers. There's more in the garage. Long, thin zebra danios. Uh, pingu guppies. More endlers. Am I still good? I'm not going. I'm going like deep this time. So if I, I might lose you, hang on. Here we go. Let's go in here. Let's go in here. Endlers. My favorite endlers. Joseph's favorite endlers. Stack endlers. Those things are super awesome. FishTube says $5 super chat. I'm speaking for the insurance company. Don't burn the house down. I will not. I will not burn the house down. There's the baby mascara barbs. Look how big they're getting. Look how big they're getting. They're getting so big. Hello. Hello, little mascara barb. Uh-oh, you want to see, you guys want to see what a real glowfish looks like? A natural glowfish? Well, bam. Do you see those? Millennium albino rainbows. They absolutely glow. They glow. Too cute. You guys are too cute. It's not being so cute. Um, Okay. So, what else? Anything else? I can try and go in the better room. If I go in there, there's a good chance I'm going Lego, Lucas. Let's see. All those bows look awesome. Look at them. And they look like they're not starving to death, so I must be doing a good job. Okay. I'm doing a good job. Here we go. Hi, Shishi. She's just dropping in to say hi. I'm going to show these bettas if I can get in here. Am I buffering? Am I buffering? Am I buffering? No. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Let's see if I can see them. Hi, buddy. Come here. Look how cute they are. No Lego Lucas? Good. Look at these bettas. I'm getting all the updates out while he's in Seattle. Nobody didn't even know. Look at these cute little bettas. He's not selling these, I don't think, or yet. I don't know. But they're adorable. Top view is the best view. Come here, guys. Come here. Can you focus on the fish? That would be great if you focused on the fish. See that fish camera? Focus on it. Not happening. They got blue on them. They got blue on them, and I love them. But my favorite, where's he at? Where's little Batman? Here he is. This is little Batman, and he's my favorite because he's got super great personality, and he's adorable. Look at him. Hello, little Batman. You're my favorite. I know. I know. You're very cute. I already showed the stack endlers, Joseph. If you were paying attention, you would have saw him. All right, people. We can either be mean to Joseph and not show them the stack endlers, or we can be nice and we can go back in there and show them. What do we think? I'm taking a poll. Sadly Punk says, $5 super chat. Show us where you hid the rope fish. I didn't yet. Yeah, I have to take him home, right? Like, 
I don't know what my bonus is if I make it a year at LRB, but I think it's that beta right there. <laughs> okay, fine. Joseph's gonna whine. Okay, as long as I don't go Lego, Lucas, let's go back in here. Let's go back in here. Show Joseph his endlers. I'm walking very slow. Whoa! Whoa, bro! No jumping allowed while the boss is away. Y'all just stay in the water and be chill. Okay, all right, here we go. Let's go this way. Hopefully I'm not Lego, Lucas. I'm very nervous about that. What do you think, Joseph? Uh-oh, Candy said uh-oh. Okay, I'm good, all right. Are you seeing these fly little fish with their fly colors? They're pretty fly. They're really going at that one female, aren't they? Calm down, bros. Jiminy Christmas. She's already been hit. I would assume they're lying, bread. Dang, chill, bros. Leave her alone. She's just chilling. Yeah, calm down, Joseph. Calm down. We're getting real aggressive with that one female. <laughs> Crazy. Okay. Uh, she's already been hit, right? <laughs> Craziness. It was an endler. There's like four of them. Black line endlers. She's got wild black bar endlers. Where are those at? I know where those are. They're up here somewhere. Hello? Hello. These guys. Endlers, endlers everywhere. Endlers, endlers everywhere. And guppies. And endlers. And crystal shrimps. Crystal shrimps. Okay. Anything else before I go sit back down in the chair? Tom says I got outbid on those Thursday. Uh, it happens. It happens. I didn't even bid on the stuff I wanted because I don't have any tank space. Wrap it up, get tacos, and go home. I probably got, what time is it? I probably got another uh, hour before I really am turning the lights off and shutting it down for the night. Uh, Goldie eyed a guy. Let's just. Go right over here. Well, bam. Do you see it? Do you see that one? It's blue and red and orange and yellow. And it's, they're in here with the hill trouts and the mascara barbs. And look at all these Taiwan lilies. Lucas planted all these before he left. They look amazing. And also, the mascara barbs didn't eat them. I planted those. I planted those. And then Lucas planted these. Yes. How are yours looking, Bob? Are they looking fly? These guys are looking fly. You want to know who runs this tank, though? You see all these crazy hill trouts and these mascara barbs and, oh, they're so crazy and they're the crazy. You guys want to know who really runs this tank right here? Because I can show you the tank boss in about two seconds. He's a jerk. He tries to bite me. And he's in charge of this whole tank. You ready for this? Are you guys ready? There he is. There's the boss. What's up, jerk? How's it going? He's in charge of the whole deal. You would think not so much, but yeah, no. That fish right there, 100% in charge. He runs the whole top of the tank. He tries to bite me. He bites the hose when I'm changing the water. Yeah, the killie. See him? See him? Big old jerk. He outcompetes all these dudes. All of them. He's aggressive. Why are you so aggressive, bro? You gonna bite me through the glass? I don't think so. Yeah, buddy. He's got small guy syndrome for sure. For sure. 
Yeah, they won't go near him. They will not go near him. Uh-uh. It's the weirdest thing. He runs that whole top half. They stay away from him. Sometimes the hill trouts will actually corral the mascara barbs down here and, like, herd them away from the killifish. When's he selling the killifish? I think they're available now through Patreon and possibly on his website. He's, we're trying to sell them. Look at him. Up there running it. Just up there running it. Look at him. He's going to... Hey. He's going to make the hill trouts back up. Look at that. Isn't he crazy? Yeah, he's like less than a quarter of their size. He's tiny, but he runs that tank. Nobody ever sees that. Lucas is always like, Look how pretty the mascara barbs are. I'm like, You all see this killifish over here just running the show? Just running it? <laughs> he cracks me up. Look at him. That hill trout tried to come at him. That was like, Oh, oh, wait a minute. That's the killifish. Dude is the boss. Absolutely insane. He runs it. Look, they're doing it. See the hill trouts? They're cor see okay, so there's hill trout, this hill trout, this hill trout. They're corralling the mascara barbs down here. They do this all the time. See the rainbows are over there. There, is growling the mascara barb. Like sheep. Have you guys ever seen like a sheep herding competition where they have to like separate the sheep and put the sheep in the right pen or whatever the dogs do? That's what these hill trouts do with these mascara barbs and these, oh, lights are going out. And these goliatic guy, they corral whatever he wants because he runs it. Absolutely insane. Some weird dynamics going on in this tank. That's uh, a little weird. Anyhow. So yeah, that's going on. I'm sitting back down. Where's my coffee? There it is. Hello, coffee. Here, you guys sit right there and stare at that green monster of a tank. Maybe you'll see a catfish one by. Did I go Lego, Lucas? Is it better now? I moved fast. I shouldn't have moved so fast. I should not have moved so fast. This place is a hot spot for Lego Lucas. Am I still Lego Lucas? Dang it, man. Is it better? Is it better? I hope it's better. Please be better. Be a little better. Lucas and his guacamole tanks, right? <sighs> that was a nice walk. I'm glad I'm not Lego Lucas anymore. Good thing I got that rack done because the light just went off. So I got one, two, three more racks of water changes to do tomorrow and fish feeding and cleaning so that everything will be perfect when Nabovs gets back. What would I do? I don't know. With what? What are we talking about? Did I say something? I think I'm gonna have tacos on my way home. Either tacos or steak and shake. Cause I can't do White Castle again. Maybe I can. Kinda sounds delicious. It kinda sounds delicious. Greg Sage talked me into rare live bears. Oh, if Steak and Shake had tacos, oh my gosh. I almost talked myself into some Americana Splendus? Splendens? What the heck were they? Some kind of live bear that Ben brought to the club meeting? I almost took those home. They have spots. I felt like Corella de Ville. I was like, oh my god, I love their spots. They were really cute. He said the males are really aggressive with each other, though. So I don't know. All I know is there's a Bashir in my quarantine tank. I can't put nothing else in there because they'll eat it. 
Well, he did. Punchy's complaining about shipping costs. Shipping costs are rough everywhere, man. Especially shipping fish. Because we got to ship water, and it's all got to be packaged. It's got to be priority. They got to be careful with it. It's a whole big deal. From what I got from Greg, I estimate I'll need to add a tank or six tanks. Nice. Nice fish, too. Very nice. Anybody else? Anybody else want to see anything or got any questions? What time is it? What time is it, Candy? I think maybe... Maybe I will go to White Castle. Did someone say Amicas? I did. Is that what I said? I think I mispronounced it. I mispronounced most things. But that's okay. What am I going to do tomorrow? I think I'm going to dye my hair on Sunday. And I think tomorrow, before I come up here, I'm going to... Test the water in the pond, see if I can move the rope fish. Should be almost one where I'm at, sweet. Means I'm getting close to being able to turn the lights off and go home. So 12.50 there, thank you. Thank you very much. Have I bred Bashirs? No, but I want to. I can't decide which one I want to breed though. Because when I do it, I'm going to put a lot of effort into it. There's like 13 different species of Bashir. I can't decide which one I want to breed. Right now I'm keeping Senegalis and I just got a Delhezi Bashir. But I haven't bred them. I'm going to though. Pond 2.0, right? We breed Bashirs in it. I don't think you need a pond to breed Bashirs. I think the pond is rope fish specific. Take a quick nap, do the waters, and go home. I already did all the waters. I just got to check on the cat to make sure Sparky has some treats. Turn the lights off. Maybe feed the discus again upstairs before I turn their light off. Their light should already be off. I got to go turn that discus light off. Getting away from live bears. Why? Live bears are fun. You know what's a fun live bear? These Selby's hat beaks. There's so many Selby's half beak babies up there. Y'all want to see this? Look at this nonsense. Let's see if I can catch them. Oh, did you see them? Did you see them? Where'd they go? Did I scare them all away with my movements? I scared them all away with my movements. Where'd you guys go? Come back. I just want to take your picture. Come back up here. This is what's going on on top of this 240, you guys. See? He took the one light down, and he added another light and another light. I'm not sure how that helps. That's like the same thing. But he's the genius, not me. So be the fish, Haley. Be the fish. Um... These fish have a 240 gallons of green water. I'm not sure being the fish is going to help me find the fish. Because those Selby's half-beaks like to run away. They like to run away because they're a little tiny. Little tiny babies. Little tiny babies. LRB's on Hippie Shrimp Jesus Time? Yeah. Actually, he's just on Time Doesn't Matter. Are those the same kind of half-beaks that Hawaiian Peacock just recently got? I am not sure. I did not see that. Punchy got nine tanks done so far. There's 17 to go. Let me see. How many tanks did I do? 7, 14, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 30. 
31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41. I did 41 including this one. Bear just texted me and wants to know if I'm headed home yet. I am not headed home yet, Bear. If you were watching my live stream, you would know that. But obviously you're not. What's up, Ty? What's up? I get caught up on the magicians. Oh, man. Maybe the bear wants me to bring him a taco. Why is the bear still awake? Jaden must not have wanted to go to sleep. Anywho. Anywho. That's a 40 minute live stream. I think that's pretty darn good. Anybody else got anything they need to say, do, think about, or talk about before we, uh, bears don't sleep without raccoons. There's no more raccoons. I got rid of them all. Anything else we need to hash out before I close this down and try to go home and not think about the fact that I'm missing out on all of the Dean goodness? That's okay, he'll come back and tell me all about it. Anybody? Nobody? Just checking you didn't burn the house down? Yeah, I didn't. You know, my fu the funny thing is that neither Sarah nor Lucas have been in my live stream. So, like, they must have a lot of confidence in me that this place is uh, all right. Because they, they really aren't checking in too much don't seem too concerned with the um, noises that I keep hearing in this haunted fish mansion Ugh. right yeah they're not they're not concerned about what I'm doing had to remind me again Haley it hurts the jealousy's ugly in me yeah if y'all know the would could, could understand the jealousy going on in my head right now, uh, you wouldn't like me so much because I'm like, I have not spotted any hidden cameras. If there are hidden cameras, they're going to see some things because it's hot in here and I'm all alone and Haley did all the water changes in her bikini today because it's hot. So if they put up cameras, I'm sure they got a show. <laughs> Hello, Discus. Goodbye, Discus. <laughs> Stuff gets weird at 1 a.m. around here, let me just tell you. Things get a little weird. Everybody's going to bed. Everybody's telling me to go to bed. Yeah, the hidden cameras would be Lego anyway, so you wouldn't catch me doing anything. The Lego cameras, Lego Lucas cameras. And the haunted fish mansion. Ah, I touched a thing. I don't know what it does. I'm agreeing with Pam earlier. They're making a sister for Wesley, right? That'd be good. Fishtube says $2 super chat to go get sleep. Now I'm being paid to leave. What's that say? <laughs> What's that say about my content? It's like, hey, here's $2. Could you go to bed? Because you really need a nap. <laughs> You can't make me fish tube. I still got coffee. Let's see if the bear figures out I'm alive and shows up. That'd be good. Yeah, I should probably feed the bear. Yeah, now I'm just messing with you. I should probably feed the bear though. Actually, the bear won't want me to bring him food home. Heck, stay on collect more. Sadly, punk. Oh, you're so crazy. Sadly, punk 1977. Remember when everybody had weird names for their email handle when we were like kids and email first happened? You know what my first ever email address was? It was hamster401. I don't even remember why I chose 401. Those numbers mean nothing to me now. Isn't that weird? Weird ramblings from my brain at 1 o'clock in the morning. 
Hamster 401 at Prodigy.net. No, it was at uh, AOL. At AOL.com. Humphrey the Bear, 1960s Disney. I've seen Humphrey the Bear. Anthony's fishy friends is finally done draining the water from his 90 gallon. How long did that take you? 40 minutes? Dang. Sadly, Punk says that's the name he's had forever. 44 Mad Guys was Pokemon. Dan Slee finally got that right. Joseph's loving this green water. I like how Joseph just randomly pops in, sees what's happening, sees if he cares about it, and then just pops back out like he doesn't have to give anybody some watch time. Thanks, Joseph. <laughs> I also really like to give Joseph some crap. Because I think that's funny. Look, Priscilla, it's radioactive. Yeah, it went nuclear. Full nuclear. Fully nuclear. Yeah, hamster401 at AOL.com. Hello, Discus. Hello, Discus. Goodbye, Discus. Good. Yeah, hey. It's funnier when you go. There we go. Okay. Joseph said everyone likes to give him crap. Priscilla, cough, cough. Priscilla, I believe Joseph is trying to say that you give him a lot of crap. Watch time? What's that? I don't know. I don't know. I try not to pay attention too much to what's going on on the YouTubes as far as, like, the analytics and what I should be doing and what I shouldn't be doing and what works well and what doesn't work well because I'm like, I just want to do what I want to do and show some people what I'm doing and if it works, it works and if it doesn't, I got videos for it. What's up, Otter Creek? How's it going? Um, daydreaming about... Now I'm thinking I really need to go to White Castle because I really need a jalapeno cheeseburger. Views are worth more than anything. I don't know. I think friends are worth more than anything. That's why I really do all of this. Because um, I have friends now, and I didn't have friends before. I mean, I had a friend. But now I have friends and, like, people that don't tell me to shut up about my fish, which is what my current friend does. <laughs> so White Castle did make me sick, but I feel like maybe it won't this time. And jalapeno cheeseburgers. And I'm a glutton for punishment, I guess. I don't know. Ty says the aggro brights are really good at making green water. I've cut my timer down to five hours a day, and they go into Phoenix's for a daily cycle. This thing, we took one light off of it. He put two more on. I, I don't know. Sickless23 says, how are you 80 pounds eating White Castle at midnight? I don't know. I eat all the burgers, and I stay set thinsk. I don't know how it works. I just eat all the burgers and then my collarbone pops out. I eat four or five at a time plus a sack of fries. I can eat like nine tacos in a sitting. Like a lot of tacos. I like food. I like deep fried food. I like food that's bad for me. I can eat an entire party sized bag of cheddar and sour cream ruffles in one night. Yes. I love to eat. Priscilla, your presence is not offensive, and Joseph can bite it. How about that? He's more funny when he's offended anyway. Plus, he's just going to talk about some fish at some point. So, still a no for tie on the White Castles. Sharpie says, you'll hit the right age and start growing outwards. Don't worry. Yeah, everybody keeps telling me that. Lucas told me it's 30. He's like, when you hit 30, that's when you start getting fat. And I'm like, well, I'm already 30. So when's that going to happen? And I had a kid. Everybody always used to tell me once I had a kid, I would get fat. Did that. That didn't happen. So I don't know. I think fat is relative. You can be a skinny person and still be fat, which is, I think, what's going on with me. You can have, like, fat deposits around your heart because you eat too much, like, cholesterol and it, like, gunks up your heart real bad. So you can be a skinny fat person, which is what I am. Like, if I was a normal human being and not a crazy dragon, um, 
with a retardedly high metabolism, I would probably weigh 400 pounds. <laughs> Shelby Ray says everyone behaves when Priscilla is around. Jeffro gets his act real right fast. It's so funny. <laughs> she don't take no nonsense. Jeffro's scared because he's got that southern gentleman thing. That that chivalry, southern, good old boy. They're very intimidated by an outspoken woman. Generally speaking. Forty four mad guy says I'm injured dragon. Where are your magical powers? I can't show you my magical powers. It's kinda like a wish where if you tell somebody it doesn't happen. Priscilla's still waiting on her metabolism to kick in. Mine kicked in like the second I was born. And never stopped. I had doctors for a long time. My parents used to take me to all these doctors for a long time trying to get me to gain weight and making me eat these like high calorie shakes and stuff that were real nasty even that didn't make me gain weight I was like I could eat like six of these I think it has something to do with my PCOS kicks my metabolism into high gear but my dad's super skinny too so I don't know Jeremy's metabolism stopped working when he turned 25 y'all are gonna jinx me I'm going to be that tiny, like, I think as I get older, I'm just going to shrink. I'm going to become a tiny, tiny old lady that, like, curses at people. Ironized yeast. Fish tube's paying me to go home again. $2 to go home? <laughs> this could become a thing, fish tube. I mean, I got energy to burn. <laughs> Sadly, Punk thinks it's a good idea if I just keep going and seeing how much money I can make to shut up. Priscilla needs to post a baby picture. I need to see your baby. Oh, I am hungry. That's right. White Castle. Hmm. I'm going to take all Fish Tube's money and bounce. Yeah, right. I'm going to take all Fish Tube's money and bounce to the, to the um, pet store, fish store local fish store. I'm pretty much in the local fish store right now, but whatever. Uh, Dansley says that he is going to be a bad influence and pay me $3 to stay. So now it's a battle. I'm at $4 to leave and $3 to stay. So currently uh, leaving is winning. And I still have coffee. Ty's right. Like this is not empty. I'm doing a highly experimental rope fish study. I need my sleep. Is this like an auction, sadly, punk? Do I hear five? Do I hear five? <laughs> it's ridiculous. You guys are awesome. But yeah, I still have coffee. Mm, there's like four more swigs in there. Like four more swigs of coffee. And I'm at 53 minutes, so... I got like seven more minutes. Green. Yellow. Green. Yellow. <laughs> Green. Yellow. Jeremy's Wild Studio says five bucks for you to decide for yourself if you want to stay or go. That's what I'm talking about. Dragon's Choice. Thanks, Jeremy. Look at this. Yellow. Green. Why is it doing that? Yellow. Joseph, why does it do that? Green. <laughs> uh, why is that so entertaining? I'm having a lot of fun with that, you guys. Otter Creek says, I'll give you however much you want to come work for me and I'll go home. Where do you work? Auto color correction. See, that's a lot of fun. They don't tell you about that when you buy the iPhone. 
that if you sit in front of a green tank, you can make it change colors. <laughs> it's the aperture of the camera. There's no aperture on this camera, is there? It's a phone. It's my cell phone. My cell phone. Or exposure, I don't know. Green? Yellow. Okay, so here's my magic trick, you guys. The dragon can do magic. Yellow tank. Green tank. Yellow tank. Green tank. Both. <laughs> Priscilla says, what are we going to do tonight? Same thing as we do every night. Try to take over the world. That's right, Pinky. Haley's doing drywall. No, I'm not. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, Pinky? Yeah, don't ruin my magic. This is dragon magic. Yellow. Green. <laughs> oh, that's so much fun. Where are we going to find penguins and a hose at this time of night? I'm not sure, but I think we can do it. Are you going to bring a pizza cutter, Pam? Because we're going to need a pizza cutter. Puff the magic dragon. Puff the magic dragon. Live by the sea. Robin says, I sympathize. I have no friends who know anything about fish. It's lonely. Right? When you have friends and then they don't, they're not into fish and you keep talking fish and they're like, shut up about your fish. Hate that. But now I have fishy friends. So my life is infinitely better. Uh-oh. Joseph, if uh, Priscilla could reach you, she would hurt you. You're digging yourself a hole, brother. And you're going to get hurt. You're going to get hurt, bro. Jeremy says, have you seen those long aquatic salamanders that look like a hybrid between a ropefish and an axolotl? An ohm? The really old blind cave salamanders? Look that up. Ohm. O-L-M. Amazing. They lived to like 100 years old. They look like a ropefish and a luck dragon had a baby and it went blind. They're amazing. Check those out. If you can get me one, send it my way. I don't know how to get one. I think they're endangered. Elliot the dragon is... Isn't that from Pete's dragon? What's the dragon's name in Pete's dragon? Elliot, right? Yeah. Never ending story is amazing. Elliot's the boy? Then why is it called Pete's dragon? Isn't the boy's name Pete? Wouldn't that make more sense? Jeremy says, oh my god, that's neat. Not what I was talking about, though. I think the salamanders I'm thinking of have faces. Yeah, no face. Did you see that thing? Wild. Those things are wild. Ohms, man, right? Mind blown. Totally mind blown. I need to source them. I don't think you can get them. I think they're, like, super endangered or whatever. Super awesome. Shelby Ray's family rolls her eyes at her. Yeah, I get that a lot. Fish tube, oddball aquatics, your favorite fish in these 300 tanks. Show us. I already showed you. It's the it's little Batman. Or, I don't know, maybe Wags. Let's see if I can find Wags. Wags is a uh, Melanotania parva. He's down there in that green water tank down there, and he has no tail. So I named him Wags. Let's see. So, where you at, Wags? Spot the Wags. Where is he? He moves different. There he is, right up front. You guys see him? With his no tail. Where'd he go? There he is. Wags, come back. Come back, Wags. Can you spot the fish with no tail? There he is. There he is. Right there in the middle. Do you see him? Oh, he jumped. Now he's gone. Yeah, Wags is probably my favorite. If I have to pick a favorite. Wags and little Batman. Wag and little Batman. They're so adorable. Little Batman the panda betta. I do love green tanks. Those are my favorite tanks, man. I love them. All right. Those are crazy. I broke it. Is it back? Did I break it? That light is horrible. That's a little better. 
Falcor is a Treyu's dragon from Never Ending Story. That's right. Falcor is the bomb.com. I unbroke it. Joseph wants green water tanks with wild endlers. Yes. For sure. Yeah, it's time for night night. Haley needs a burger. And I gotta get out of here. I don't know where Sparky is, but I gotta go find him and make sure he has treats. Lesser Sirens. Okay, I'll Google it. Jeremy's Wild Studio. I will Google it. Sweet dreams, everyone. I'm going to get White Castles. Hopefully, they don't hurt my belly. Eat the burger. Don't forget food for the bear. I gotta call the bear. Thank you for reminding me, Dan Slee. I have to call the bear because he texted me. All right. See you guys later. Say bye-bye, Green Tank. Bye-bye, Green Tank.